It's the most chaotic time of the year. I lost the... It was somewhere in there. You did pretty well, though. Yeah. Whether you're a parent or not, there's a lot on our plates, especially this week. But sometimes getting dinner on that plate gets neglected. Well, not today, because mm -hmm. Chef Crystal Baldwin <laughs> is here with some easy on-the-go recipes. You have three of them for us, so what I are do. we doing first? We're going to do this nacho casserole, but it's a sweet potato it, nacho casserole. What? So good. Why, yes. Okay. So, okay. We're gonna take our sweet potatoes. I slice some sweet potatoes here, right? And quarter inch thick. Okay. And I'm gonna add some olive oil to it. Okay. I have to tell you, I've been nibbling on these, uh, several of them. They, they are so good. Do you wanna try one? They're so good. Sure, I'm not okay. even a big well, sweet potato fan. I understand that. Well, uh, no, in fact, I don't really like sweet potatoes, so you? this is really gonna be a test. And it's for like me. sweet potatoes, you know, like a certain way everybody thinks, like candied sweet potatoes, mm -hmm. something like that. But I like that savoriness to mm -hmm. it, so it makes it really rather tasty. So you put a taco uh, seasoning on them? I don't mind this. Which there you is go, so and I'm gonna take that as a win. Right? Yes. Yes. That is a true <laughs> win right there. Right, you just, do. <laughs> so. so you just poured a packet of uh, taco, taco seasoning. seasoning on. We're not doing anything fancy, it's taco seasoning. My it's gonna gosh. taste great though. Yeah, so I you stir you this up. It does transform this, look, I'm going in for a second. See, there so you go. You're doing something right. You stir it up. Put it on the sheet tray and bake it. Mm -hmm. right. While it's baking, mm. you take some ground beef and ground beef. You should get it while it's on sale. So they'll is make that, it you, nice. Is that, and, is that a subtle hint? I'm just saying. <laughs> you may want to go to the store and get some ground beef, right? <laughs> so I got some ground beef, mm -hmm. uh, and that's what the theme is too, because we're already spending a lot of money right now. So mm -hmm. something mm. tasty, something quick. Mm -hmm. So brown that ground beef off, and then I'm going to take and put. Oh my gosh. Just, this is salsa? No, no, no. So, is it just salsa? No, it's not just salsa. It is. <laughs> is it the Market District salsa? This, is, this one is actually the Giant Eagle Medium. Mm hmm. It is it's so really flipping good. good. Really? It's so fresh tasting. I it's get. It's really good. I get the hot salsa. Oh, yes. The hot is amazing. I get made it because that was mild, and then this was medium, and I kept looking at the hot, and I went, all right, I'll pause. Yeah, but it is. It's the, really, really the good. mango peach one too. Yeah. Oh man, those salsas He's are. He's looking at us I like, are you serious? Missing out? You have really, you know about really this. Good. They're really it's the good. best it's salsa. Fresh and and mm -hmm. just very tasty. So is it? Just I mean, not salsa. that there's anything wrong with a jar salsa, but <laughs> it's good, right? There is something wrong with it. when you had this. You know the difference. <laughs> <laughs> man, then all those people going like, but but I like my jar. So nothing wrong with that. Mm. Salsa. Mm -hmm. Then we take and put it in a baking dish. And we put cheese on top because you can't have a nacho without right, cheese, right? right? Mm -hmm. Now you guys are going to do a little bit of garnishing, right? Mm -hmm. oh, I've got okay. a little bit of sour cream over there. Cool. So you're going to take a picture of sour cream on it. Right. We're just doing dollops yeah, of sour dollop cream on the, the top. Yeah, sour cream okay. on top. I love and then the melted cheese. A little cheese bit on top. of cilantro on oh, there. Oh, I can do that. You do the sour cream. And then you guys. Can we, we can dig into that we one. We can dig into that. Because we've been eating the other one. Oh, also, that's fine too. So this one. I have a Mediterranean bowl while you guys are So okay. I have rice that it, there's some turmeric in it, right? Okay. And then I'm going to take and put in some chickpeas and just warm those up. Now I already cooked off ground beef mm -hmm. and it has a shawarma seasoning in it. This? So if you find mm -hmm. a gyro seasoning, a shawarma right, seasoning, right. and some cumin, right? I want to try and this. And then we have mind? a bowl. Yeah, please. And then there's a bowl over there, mm. so we're going to build this, right? Okay. What is the bowl you want? You this. Take that bowl. That's okay. Fine. I'm busy trying to get. I want sample. you to eat. That's <laughs> fine. Well, mm. I love what you do, and I'm I'm picking up what you're doing here because yes. you bought maybe three pounds of ground That's beef exactly so it. that you can expand mm -hmm. this different recipe. flavors. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. So then cucumbers, tomatoes, a little bit of crushed uh, red pepper and onions. You mix that up, and then you take and you put the rice down at the bottom of the bowl, mm -hmm. and then you take and put your ground beef on top, and then this cucumber salad. And then garnish it with some lemon mm. and some cilantro, and you have a totally different taste profile. Right. Is that what that, this is? That is a lasagna bowl. A lasagna oh! Vegetable bowl. All so, right, well, tell us about this. So vegetable so lasagna. lasagna. Yes, so it is lasagna noodles. I can't stop eating these. It potatoes. is sauce, and then it is your ground meat, and then carrots and peppers and mushrooms and onions, and then you put mm. your ricotta cheese on top, which I Look love all ricotta that. cheese. <gasps> oh, uh, yes. Just, and on I love top it. of pasta. Oh, yes, it's so good. It so really good. is. And that's a whole milk ricotta cheese. And mm. I love, um, I like it as a dessert, too. It's really creamy, and you can put cherries or any fresh fruit on it. Sign me up. It's just 
one of my favorite desserts that as well. That sounds good. I've never had So that. three different tastes, you know, but it's ground meat mm -hmm. and everything is truly less than 30 minutes. Right. I so love that it's quick. It, mm. it, is, yeah. it is really, really awesome to and do. And this would be great at a party. It would be. And yeah. it would surprise people. I'm yeah. telling you, you gotta, exactly. it, and not in a bad way. They're no. all yes. good. <laughs> They're all good. I haven't tried the bowl yet. This is so wonderful. This is like, it is such a star. Given that we don't like oh. sweet potatoes, it's so, so good. Yeah, no, this would, I would be excited mm. to see mm. this at a party. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Surprise people in a good way. Chef all right. Russell, thank you. You're welcome. And as always, for these recipes and more, mm. look for the Cooking Corner tab right there on our website.